All right, hello Saberland, this is MK Sabers. <clears throat> and can you believe this is going to be Graflex serial number 23, 23rd Saber that uh, MK Sabers has made. Um, I'm gonna go over the features of this. This is a Force Awakens um, Saber. I wanna go through some of the um, uh, features of this Saber. So uh, this is a Graflex uh, 2.0, uh, actually a 2.1, excuse me. Um, it's some of the stock that I had around and and every once in a while I'll put uh, put them together I think I've got some 2.5s that are coming up uh, that I'll be putting some nano biscotti fours in P4s in so this is a, a 2.1 it does have some accuracy upgrades so uh, I've done the screw upgrade so uh, I like starting from the top so um, I changed the button so it usually comes with an anodized button this has been replaced with the color accurate plastic button it has the fake KR Sabers uh, power uh, um, power switch screw on it. This does not move. Um, uh, the Nano Biscotti doesn't have an aux func function, so um, that's a fake fake button there. Um, I didn't put on a flat beer tab on that uh, on this one. Um, I could. Uh, it'd be an extra ten bucks, but uh, um, I kind of like the. At least to let people know it's a 2.1 but uh, if you're interested in that uh, of doing the uh, um, if, if you want to be the purchaser of this and you want to upgrade that flat beer tab just let me know um, added the foil tabs by the pins screw upgrade so the screws the, the, the torque screws that come with the kit have been replaced uh, I filed down the glass eye uh, this is the original 2.0 eye so it's not the frosted or clear eye um, but it's been filed down. This is also the blade retention. So to take out the blade plug, it's got a uh, Custom Saber Shop blade plug in here. If you want to take that out, loosen up, squeeze the bunny ears, and that blade plug comes out. This has got a uh, blue, royal blue, white tricree in it. You can see it in there in the lens, in, the, in, in there. Um, let's say blade plug. A Wanawanga TFA translucent uh, circuit card upgrade. I've added rivets to the grips as well as the D ring. So everything's rivets. And like with any 2.0, this has got a Knight's Goth 3D uh, uh, Knight's chassis in it. And so um, we'll unscrew that. So for this chassis, um, because it's a 2.0, it unscrews, and we've got the uh, um, uh, Goth Knights chassis um, with the brass accents. A real, um, uh, what do I want to say? Uh, crystal. It's a it's a real quartz crystal. It is not the 3D printed version. This is sporting the 3400 milliamp. Um, lithium ion battery, rechargeable battery. Um, Nano Biscotti version 4, Tricree. Um, I added some little uh, wire accents to the, you can kind of see it there with the lighting, some wire accents to the uh, to the chassis there. Access to the SD card, you can see the SD card right in there. If you've got good fingernails, you can uh, pop out the SD card. There's the SD card for the Nano Biscotti. Nice access there. We're loading on three fonts. Charge key, uh, charge and kill key. So if you rotate it, it actually turns on the saver. Um, I call this the, the light side saver. Um, I went a little bit different here. Instead of doing a blue crystal, I decided to do a white crystal. You see it's extremely bright here. It's bright in person, bright in video. And then I did a green accent LED. I, I tend to do like blue crystals with red accent LEDs, but I decided to go a little off script and I did a white crystal with a green accent LED. And so it's kind of got like light side colors, um, which I really enjoy. Hand painted. If you want to get to the charge charging port, just pull this, uh, the, the kill key out. Pull the kill key out. Then you have access to the charging port. It does come with a smart charger and stand, so with all MK Sabers, um, I include a, a 3D printed stand. 
Um, this is just a, a demo blade to fit on the screen. Uh, I'll also include a um, 32 inch medium grade uh, uh, blade with it and, and smart charger. So it comes with the, the whole pack. And so smart charger, very easy to use. Charging port, it's a 2.1 millimeter charging jack. Everything's lined up. You plug it into the charging port. The LED on the charger will turn red while it's charging, green when it's done. This is the 500 milliamp um, uh, charger. So it takes anywhere from four to eight hours of charge, depending on how dead the battery is. Um, premium speaker, 28 millimeter premium speaker in here. I tend to like the premium speakers. They have a bed, better range. And this saber is just extremely loud. So blue, royal blue. Uh, tri Cree with a white flash on clash. Extremely loud saber. Tweaked really nice with the Nano Biscotti 4. I'll put on the test blade here. Again, to put on a blade, unscrew, get out the blade plug, put in the blade, tighten it up. And what I like about this chassis. is that it's loud and it gets even louder when you put it together. Beautiful shine through. I just like that. That's one of the best things I like about the Graflex, uh, the 2.0s, any, any of the replicas, is the shine through right here. I just love that. A wonderful saber. Show we'll uh, have it together so you can hear what it's like. I usually do one to two twists. Close it up. Still extremely loud. And I, you can see some of the accent features coming through the grill ports on the bottom there, making it louder. And another reason it's loud is because. Um, when I put in the rivets, I knock out the uh, I knock out the holes, the the, the rivet pulls, and so those are the, all the rivets are hollow, and so you get a little bit more sound out of there as well. So there you go, serial number twenty three TFA Graflex, for sale in my Etsy store. First come, first serve. May the force be with you. And there you go. Thank you very much for watching my video.